So here now, Trinidad has four species of boas and Tobago has three. And out of the species we have, TNT only has one true tree boa. It goes by many names and depending on which part of TNT you go or who you talk to, you might hear one of these names. Trinidad tree boa, Cascabel dormillon, Cascabel, black-tailed tree boa, Cook's tree boa, Russian burgers tree boa, tree boa, neotropical tree boa, common tree boa, tree boa constrictor, Russian burgers gratin boa, Cook's boa, yellow tree boa, yellow marble tree boa, Castabel, Cascabelli, Dormillion, Horsewhip, Mapenari, Mangrove tree boa, Mangrove Cascabel, Mangrove Dormillion, Mango snake, Mangrove snake, Sleeping rattlesnake, False Manapari, or Mango Mapapi, Corallus Russian Burgeri. Now despite some of those names, they are non-venomous and don't have a rattle. It got the name Cascabel and Rattlesnake because of the patterns on the juvenile. Some travelers and explorers found it looked similar and mistook it for the rattlesnake that is found in South America. Just as stated before, they are arboreal snakes, meaning they spend most of their time up in the trees and seldom coming down to the ground. You can find them in forests and swamps, but they have been seen in suburbs. Some people think and have told me that tree boas have fangs, but in fact, that's just their teeth not fangs. Because they spend so much time up in the trees, their food items are also arboreal. For instance, like birds, rodents, and bats. So when they strike and catch their prey, their long teeth helps them to keep a hold of their food so it wouldn't fall. They feed mainly on birds, bats, and rodents, but will go after frogs and lizards. Tree boas are ambush predators. They mainly hunt at night and lie in wait for their prey. Once it gets close enough, they will strike out, grab it, and constrict them until they can't breed anymore. They have been seen breeding around February to April, and juveniles are born around August and September. Tree boas are ovoviviparous, meaning they don't lay their eggs. They give birth to around 20 to 30 baby snakes. The baby tree boas look almost like a totally different type of snake. They have rings and spots, and sometimes these stripes. But the older they get, the rings and spots, they fade. They can grow to an average size of around 5 to 7 feet. Tree boas are not aggressive snakes. They are very defensive, especially when you pull them out of a tree. So, as you all know, I am the Wildlife Master. Like, share, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, blessings and bless out.